Where did they go? They went into another room. Oh, right. Do you miss them or do you quite like these toys? I like these toys. Just adorable. Matt Caldwell is acting head of the Ilminster Avenue Nursery School, which implemented the scheme. Morning to you. Good morning. I mean, it had a great effect, didn't it? But why did you decide to take the toys away in the first place? Um, it's a, a project that they do in, um, have been doing in Germany since the 1990s, and I just thought I'd try it myself, really. Um, so it, you, just, you just see what happens. You remove the toys, talk to the children, talk to the parents, talk to the staff, and you just sit back and watch what happens, and it is quite interesting. What happens? Well, initially people are really worried that, that you know, there won't be enough things to do, or, or what will the children actually play with and they play with each other they get more creative they use more language um, maybe a few less arguments as well um, fighting over the same toys for instance and you just see more creativity and imagination i think and when you go outside and reading because you have bikes and plastic toys outside that's where a lot of the arguments happen in, in my experience that all went to i guess yeah, it did. I mean, we we always have lots of natural objects outside, but just removing those one or two things, um, yeah, it just, just made things uh, run a lot more smoothly. So it's taught them to be a lot more creative and, and to communicate with one another more, would you say? Yeah, definitely. I think in, in all the classrooms, everyone was really surprised uh, with just the level of language. We asked all of our practitioners to, to, to have a think about it throughout the whole month. And they, they, could, they could put numbers to it, and they said, yeah, that children were, you know, playing more creatively. At least 50% more children were playing creatively than, than they were before. And I guess we're, because children are becoming a lot more insular, or can be, with devices and such, this is a great way of them to come out of themselves and engage with what's happening around them and other friends around them, people around them. Yeah, it was interesting talking to the parents on the gate because very quickly, even though we were talking about toys, that they started very quickly talking about screens, how children have to so much. Um, we talked about plastic, we talked about all sorts of things. It's that classic thing at Christmas where yeah. you, you yeah. give the child the toy, they play with the cardboard box, isn't it, Claire? Yeah, absolutely. Listen, it's fantastic and I know you're one of 12 local authority nursery schools, but you're going to be sharing your findings and practices. Uh, with others around you. It's fantastic uh, research. Thanks for bringing it to us on Five My Breakfast. Matt Caldwell there from Ilminster Avenue Nursery School. Thank you. Plus the news and more live Premier League football than anyone else. This is...